What's going on guys? My name is Jake with Export Academy. In the last video, I showed you how you can teleport in any game using hotkeys with Cheat Engine. However, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily find your addresses much faster using the dissect data structure options with Cheat Engine. Let's check it out. Welcome back guys, so before I cover this tutorial, it's going to be really short and sweet. I just want to tell you what a class or a struct is in general before we start dissecting. So really, if you have any experience of programming or none at all, that's fine. But just know that a class or a struct in a programming language is a way to define an object or something in code. So for instance, if you want to make a character in a game, you're going to create a class that is called, say, character, for example. And inside that class, you define what the character's health is going to be, their run speed, uh, how much ammo they can carry, and stuff like that. So using this dissect data structure feature in Cheat Engine allows us to find all those variables right next to each other. That way, we don't have to scan individually for each thing involving our character. So of course, let me show you how to do this. Go ahead and attach Cheat Engine to the process you're trying to hack. In my case, is Assault Cube. So I'm going to attach Assault Cube, click Open, and now scan for one value. So I'm going to search for my health because I think it's the easiest to find. So I know that my health is a 4 byte value. So I'm going to type in 100 because my health is 100 and do a first scan. And then I'm going to try to find a grenade to hurt myself. So I'm going to look around real quick. Of course, I'm not going to find anything. Probably should have did this beforehand. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, here we go. Alright, I got my grenade. I'm going to throw it at a wall and hope I don't kill myself. So let's see. There we go, guys. Alright, now we're down to 48 health. So now if I go back to Cheat Engine and search for 48, next scan, we should have my health right here. And I'm going to drop that down and modify it with 100. And there we go. We are back at 100 health. So, now to dissect the data structure, which is going to pull up every variable around my health, I right-click the address that you're trying to dissect. So, for instance, my health. Right-click, go down to browse this memory region and go to the top of tools here and go to dissect data structures and you can leave this as is and go to structures define new structure you can give whatever name you want I'm just gonna put uh, health for example I guess and hit OK and it's gonna ask do you want cheat engine to try and fill out the most basic types of structs using the current address click yes and this is how big of the structure that you want uh, to pull up so this right here is 4,000 bytes. That's okay. We're just going to click OK. And here you go. So, right now, this is what it pulls up for me. So, I can tell just by looking at this right now. This, of course, is my health. I don't know what the 1 and 50 is, but I do know that I have a 40 and I have a 20. So, right down here, you see 40 is my ammo pile and 20 is what I have in my gun. So, to add these to your address list, you can right click and go to add to address list or press the A key and keep scrolling down see if I find anything that looks pretty interesting that looks like my name in the game so I'm gonna take that as well keep going down and it looks like we have possibly our characters X and Y Z positions it's pretty interesting but I'm just gonna stop with what I got now so you can tell here that this is possibly my ammo so I'm gonna freeze it and you can tell right there BAM we found my ammo, my ammo pile, and my uh, my name in just a couple seconds. So we don't have to scan individually for everything. So for example, if you jump up and uh, scan for your Z position in the game, if you dissect the data structure 9 times out of 10, your X and Y positions as well will be right under your Z position. So you can do this to easily find your addresses. That way you don't have to constantly move back and forth and fight for every single value. <laughs> and sometimes you might not even find them. So using the dissect data structure feature in Cheat Engine is really handy and will really speed up your scanning processes. So that's it guys, thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you next time.